We're going to make this really cool ant farm. And I'll spin it around so you can see what it is. It's made out of two CD cases, clear ones. And you can get an idea of what it looks like on the top here. And that is what we're going to be doing. These are the materials that we're going to be using, and the easiest way to deal with this is we're going to have a list of materials for you that you can go ahead and get off the website. But in the meantime, you can get an idea. If you just freeze the frame, you can see that we have everything from aluminum foil to several kinds of cutters, uh, ruler, metal ruler for cutting. Make sure you get your CD cases, which are really important. These are the ones you can get at the thrift store. Old music CD cases are great. You need soil, and the soil needs to come from the area that the ants were collected so that they're in their same kind of environment. And uh, this is a beaker for measuring, but you could use anything else. It could just be a regular measuring cup that would work fine, paper towels for a little bit of cleaning, and that would be it. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to take the inner piece out of the CD cases. So I'm going to open up the CD case. I'm just going to pop that, that piece out. Let's see if I can get it without breaking it or anything else. There we go. Okay. So that one is done. We'll do the same thing on the other case. have two empty cases and two and inserts. Two inserts. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to be putting in the hole that's located inside of the container. So open that up so the ants can get in and out of So I'm going to take one of those CD cases and we're going to put the bottom part of the hole uh, right where there's a natural little opening in the CD case. So the top CD case is going to sit on, on one underneath and we're going to line it up so that, sure, so that there's going to be a hole that goes through one of the holes in the lower case. That's going to line up with this natural opening here on the case. I'm going to reposition uh, the top case okay. onto the one underneath okay. uh, at a diagonal. Okay. And then while I'm holding that, I'm going to take a pen. Let me just do it right there. Okay. okay. Take a pen and I'm going to just mark the location of that. Okay. And the next step is going to be to drill that hole okay. in the plastic. All right. And you could, if you have a homemaker that has a drill, you could use a drill, but you have to be very, very careful because it's very brittle plastic and it will crack. Right. It's actually easier to use the so knife. What we're going to do is use an X-Acto knife. And this is where we want to make sure that if you're young or not really good with sharp instruments, you should have someone around to supervise and make sure no one gets hurt. So I'm just going to take the X-Acto knife and gradually drill the hole. Okay. So now I've got a hole. A hole. So then I need to get the bottom set ready so that that hole corresponds to an opening in the bottom case. Right. So on this piece, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, enlarge this part right here. I'm going to score along those edges. Okay. 
Cool. So there's a hole in this side. Okay. We also need to make sure that the plastic on the opposite side is also removed, about half size there. Okay, so uh, to do that, I open this up again. Uh, right here. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to make a cover for the farm. So what you can see right here is a nice shiny aluminum foil cover that will keep light out uh, from the inside of the farm. So when you're not looking at when it, when you're not looking at it, right. just covers uh, okay. the farm really well. We're going to take some aluminum foil and we're just going to take out a nice long strip of that. Okay. Good. About that long. Cut right. that right. off. Okay, and then I'm going to take the CD case mm -hmm. and put that in the middle. I'm going to use that as a guide to figure out where to put folds mm -hmm. on top. Next, we need to seal some of the holes on the bottom case. Okay. So, the hole here, right. and also the hole right here. So, we're going to use packing tape to do that. Cut a strip of that. Okay. Then, I'm going to put that onto the bottom of the case. Actually, for the other side, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to use another little strip of tape. I'm just going to put that right across the top. This one is temporary, so I'm just going to leave it like that. Eventually, we're going to have to take it off so that uh, the ants can get through this hole. Right. So, and we're, right now, we're putting this on so we can fill this with dirt. 